why don't you tell us how you got started in this business uh, to begin with? Well, I was an artist before I was a hairdresser and I always knew that I wanted to be a hairdresser and because it was so easy to, to transfer from, from an artist to a hairdresser because it's very similar. And I knew I would be good at it and I always wanted to make people happy and, and make them look good. And I, I knew that I had the ability to do that. I just had to study that. So that's why I started. Um, did you see somebody first doing hair systems and you decided you wanted to be involved with it or how, uh, how did your interest get specific with hair? Well, uh, I actually worked with a guy that many years ago in the 80s uh, was doing hair system and when I was looking at him doing the hair system I always knew that I can improve this. I wanted to do a hair piece that doesn't look like a hair piece. I knew I can do it I, and I can search for factories who can make me single hair graft system. The finest hairline in the, in the front where nobody can detect the hairline. So I search for those factories and I find them. I find people that can do a great job on a hair system that would never look like a hair piece. In order to duplicate human hair growth, the hairline is never a straight hairline like somebody draw it with a line. So I had to develop a lace where the hair comes out not in a straight line and very fine in the front so when people look at you close it doesn't look like it's a hair piece. And plus when people look in the back of your head and see a bunch of hair coming on the lace or something that looked like chicken wire that doesn't look natural to me so I had to develop a skin based system where you actually see a hair coming one at a time and it looks like your own hair. Okay, Tamir, why don't you show us an example of what you mean by a skin-based system? Well, let me show you very closely what a skin-based system look like. It's basically duplicating human hair growth. What we did is we inject one at a time hair, as you can see here, one at a time into a scalp-looking system. So when somebody is actually going to look at you from the top of your head or from the side of your hair, it looks like your own hair. One of the things that people are concerned with is how their hair looks when the wind blows, even if it's their own hair. But if you have a hair system, you want it to look natural. Let me do this demonstration right now with the blow dryer, and you can see how the hair follow and flow like, like your own hair. And you see, after I blew dyed the hair, the hair went back to its natural position. You know, it didn't stick up or anything like that because it is built like your own hair. Well, what about the front of the hair? Well, the front of the hair, what we do, we build a lace in front of the hair. So when we do the lace in front of the hair, it will give you an illusion like the hair is growing out of your scalp. So let me show you the, the front of the hair. In order to make it look natural, you gotta have lace in the front. And when you have lace in the front, and it's right on your skin, it looks like it's popping out of your scalp. So it doesn't look like the hair is even in the front. And that will give you a very natural look in the hairline. The system that you have there uh, what does it feel like? Is it is it lightweight? Is it flexible? Maybe tell us a little bit about that. The good thing about those this system, when you put your finger through them, it feels like your own skin, basically. Mm. So when people run their finger through your hair, it feels like your own skin because right. you got the, the texture of your own skin. Right. And the nice thing is they're very lightweight. Mm. So when it's on your head, you, you can hardly feel like you have something on your head. Right. And also, the good thing about this system, it's, it's transparent. So whatever color you have, you know, of skin color, it will show through it. So if you have dark complexion skin, or you have light complexion skin, it will show through that. And washing the hair and taking care of it is just like your, your natural hair. It's like your own hair. We, we develop a system with human hair that never been processed. This is a virgin hair that never been processed. The minute you start processing human hair, it would be dry and tangled. This is a virgin hair that's never been processed, so you can use any shampoo 
I would recommend maybe uh, shampoo with less chemicals so the system would last a lot longer than How long harsh. do they last? System usually, if you take care of them, they could last anywhere between six months to a year. If you're a swimmer or you're very active, if you get eight months out of it, you should be happy. What are the reasons why someone would choose a standard hair system? People that would choose standard hair system is people that change the system very often and they don't want to spend the money on, on custom made system. And plus, they have a very standard head, so it can fit them. Not, stock unit cannot fit everybody's head. That's so, why they call them stock unit. A lot of the time, some people walk into the, my place and they say, I want hair today. I cannot wait two months for the hair to be built. So that's why we carry the stock unit. Because when we have stock unit out on the shelf, we can put them right that day and the person who came here today with no hair could leave an hour later with hair. Yeah, I got the best stock system that out there for people that can't afford the custom made. Because there's a lot of people who cannot afford the custom made, so we have to make something for people that don't have the fun and it still looks good. You gotta come to us. Let us, the professional, pick the best one for you so you feel confident when you get out in the public. You want something that looks real and natural. Don't buy anything from the internet and waste your money. So I would recommend to have a visit. It's free and you have nothing to lose, just to gain. All right, thanks a lot, Tamir. You're welcome.